What's up? It's John Bat 426 here on The Great Expanse. And I'm doing my first reaction on this channel, The Great Expanse by John Bat 426 And it's I Am Groot. I had no idea they were coming out with a Groot movie. I mean, I wasn't a fan of Guardians of the Galaxy 2. I liked part one. Part two was a little all over the place for me. You know, the David Hasselhoff cameo and the just the silliness. I really love Yondu in that movie, but overall I don't have a lot of affection for it, but it was all right if that makes any sense. But anyway, this is I Am Groot. I know nothing about this, and here we go. Let's try that again. Wait, three, two, wait, three, two, one, three, Two, one, go. Three, two, one, go. From the studio that brought you Avengers Infinity War, Avengers Endgame, comes a hero. Oh my god, a few words. Three actually. It has a Minions vibe to it. It's like the Forge from The Last Jedi meet Groove Minions. So clearly this is a child's movie. A very small, impressionable child's movie. Oh lord. On August 10th, the Shrek lettering. Five new shorts. Oh, so it's not one movie. Only on Disney Plus. Thank God it didn't touch the theater. I don't think any theater would have wanted any piece of this. There's no short streaming August 10th. Marvel Studios, Disney Plus. And that's all I needed to see to know that I won't be watching. Yet, that's just my honest reaction. This is the first time I've seen this. This will be the last time I've seen this. So unless Thanos shows up, unless the stranger or any of the other cosmic beings are in it like the living tribunal or galactus makes a cameo i won't be touching this with the 39 and a half foot pole hence the you're a mean one mr grinch so sorry about that well i'm not gonna say sorry about that but that's just an honest reaction to this this looks like poop to me and i won't be watching but you can watch if you want and you can let me know how you feel about how i feel that makes sense yeah yeah, in the comments, you can say, Hey, dude, get used to it, man. Just try not to think about it too much. I always think about things. But anyway, you can respond vehemently, or you can concur, or just disagree and be obnoxious as you want. But uh, this is a no for me. 